What's up guys? We have a lot of big Roblox news today. There's a Roblox glitch that is going rampant around the Roblox community and is it's breaking Roblox quite honestly. Um mothers being mad at Roblox. I know it's crazy. And just a lot more stuff such as TikTok being angry at said mother. It's a crazy video today. I'm not even going to lie. But first before we get started, talk to my uncle Al. Hey brothers, listen, I just heard from Aunt Sally that Chase Rooney is close to a million subscribers. So here's the deal. You subscribe to him right now and guess what? I'm gonna run you over with my truck. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, video time. So if I sound weird in this video, uh, it's because I'm recording it at 5 a.m. So I have to be a little bit quiet. I'm also very tired. I have a stomach ache. I have heartburn. I don't think it could get any worse. Okay, I could be dead, but that that's besides the point. But anyways, we got a lot of Roblox news to do right now uh, because I'm bored and I can't sleep and I'm in pain and L plus ratio. Quite honestly, bro. But anyways, let's get started with some smaller stories that I've missed over the past couple days somehow. People have beat this story to death, but I would need to talk about it because I, I don't think I have. I think I was going to talk about it in my last video. But I didn't. So I'm just going to talk about it now again. If I'm talking about a double, sorry guys. I've been up for like 20 billion hours. If you don't know what I mean by this story and you somehow haven't seen it already. Chisels made a video on it. Kaneko's made a video on it. It's time for my, my, my input. It bad. So basically what Roblox did is they actually removed the community creations tab from the catalog. If you haven't noticed already, I highly doubt you have. But if you have, that's what happened. Now, it's weird that they removed this because if you don't know what it was and you can't infer <laughs> somehow, community creations tab was basically the tab where all UGC stuff would be. That's it. It was good for disco discovering, like, some fancy items sometimes. But, I mean, I guess it wasn't used as much. I mean, the recommended tab is pretty good for finding some funny items. But, uh, that that's really it, honestly. But yeah, TLDR, they removed it. So, you can't really just only look at UGC things. You can still search for individual UGC creators' items. But you can't search for UGC only anymore. Which I guess is fine because UGC stuff is still mixed in with the main tabs now. If you go to like just hats in general, it's going to be UGC and Roblox instead of just Roblox or just UGC. Kind of a weird update and I think it's like good but also like kind of bad. I don't know how much discovery it gave to UGC creators. I have seen a lot of UGC creators kind of against this and uh, I don't know. I'm a bit torn on it. I am not a UGC creator so that, that's probably why I don't really care as much but I, I kind of understand the frustration but I also don't. It's, it's a very wishy-washy kind of situation. Um, tell me what you think in the comments, quite honestly. Yeah, that's a small little story. Uh, people were kind of mad about it. I don't know. But now let's move on to a bigger story, which is, um, uh, I'm gonna talk about a little bit more about voice chat, because I talked about it in my last video, and, uh, there's been some updates, okay? I was right. So, I just want to confirm, because in my last video, I was kind of, like, teetering around how the new voice chat system works, but now we know for a fact, and I was right in my last video anyways, but if you haven't heard already, TLDR, if you have a verified phone number on your, uh, Roblox account, you have a chance of actually getting access to voice chat and i think in the future roblox is going to make it so if you have a verified phone number or email you can just have voice chat oh and you have to be over 13 so yeah that's the that's the new rules for voice chat if you haven't known it has been confirmed so uh i was right guys <laughs> i was right i'm always the best news guy ever that's why you should subscribe right now i'm the best news man news <laughs> voice chat yeah creecraft made an updated video on it uh he gave some good insight a little bit scared of this update <laughs> i'm not gonna lie you know same with the gifting update like it's good on paper but it's also it's gonna open up a lot of doors for some malicious things and i just hope roblox keeps it under wraps i know in the little warning thing that pops up they actually have like a little prompt that says like they're gonna moderate you and like record your what you're saying and stuff which a lot of people were kind of against but i think it's fine i mean they're not really like saving the recordings they're probably just putting it through an ai to see if you say any swear words in, in like a bad context or something and another thing is they do i think use context with voice chat i mean throughout the voice chat beta that's been out for like a year at this point i've seen a lot of people just swear and i mean it's and roblox doesn't really seem to care too too much unless you're like just being stupid <laughs> but yeah that's what's going on with voice chat but now let's move on to another kind of big story depending on if you even care about what this is rb battles now there's big story that go with rb battles that uh, have happened over the past couple days but it is back apparently i don't know the whole specifics with rb battles and how it works and why people care i just know there's a lot of youtubers i think the last one i watched was with like creecraft and tanker 
and Dennis on Arsenal. So I think that was like a year ago at this point now. I don't know if that was the last one ever, but that's the last one I watched. So I mean, yeah, TLDR, if you don't know what RB Battles is, it's like a kind of Roblox event. Half, it's like half with Roblox, but mostly ran by, uh, I think DJ Monopoly, uh, uh, Russo Plays. I f I'm forgetting someone. I know I'm forgetting someone and I'm sorry, but um, yeah, it's run by like some community and YouTubers and stuff like that. And uh, it, it has a lot of YouTubers in it, which is really cool. And uh, yeah, it's a really, really cool event, but there's issues with it already because th they record it in advance, you know? So what they do is they record it in like months advance, I think, I think. And um, the, the winner was leaked. Now I'm not going to show it in this video, obviously, because I don't want to ruin watch the RB battles. I don't want to spoil it for you. So uh, Twitter was in a kind of a frenzy a couple days ago because uh, he leaked that he won. So, uh, yeah, but it was leaked. So, and I've also seen a lot of people commenting saying, doesn't this happen with every RB battles? This is just a publicity stunt. You know what? If it is, that's genius. That's genius. I got to do something like that. <laughs> but yeah, I got a lot of eyes on it. Even I saw it and I don't really care too much about RB battles, but I think it's really cool. But now let's move on to the juiciest stories. The last two, which are extremely juicy. And let's get onto the Roblox glitch because that's probably what you're here for. And yeah, if you've been on Roblox for the past couple days, you might have noticed this. As you can see, he has a Family Guy Chris pr uh, profile picture on Roblox. How do you do that, you might be asking? Well, I'll probably- I'm gonna tell you, but I I'm not saying it's good. So, I've seen some TikToks rumoring that you might get banned for this. I'm pretty sure you don't, and it's just a myth. So, basically, how people are doing this is there's a new update that th that's coming soon to Roblox where you can pose your characters in your thumbnails. Now, you might be asking, but how does that correlate to having just a JPEG as your profile picture? Because there's actually a special thing of code that you can put into your Google Chrome. By the way, do not put random code into your Google Chrome, okay? I will show, like, a, a snippet of code that people that I've seen people use. Do not even use it. This is just an example. I don't know if it's bad. If you're smart and you understand code, then do it, okay? Don't trust me. I'm stupid, okay? <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. Don't trust anyone else. They're also stupid. Unless it's, like, a better YouTuber, like Sharkblocks or something, because he, he he's pretty smart. Yeah, TLDR, people are taking uh, this chunk of code. You can see it right here. I'm, I'm, I'm not saying type it in your thing instantly, okay? And basically what this code does is it when you have your character in 2d mode on your little player on your like avatar thing it basically just zooms into your chest <laughs> so if you just put like a random t-shirt on it's basically your profile picture. that's it it's really cool and i think it's a cool update but uh, i think it's kind of destroying roblox because the amount of terrible pictures i've seen with this update is astounding every time i go on twitter i just see like disgusting images that are that use this same little trick stop that okay please i'm sick of it i'm sick of seeing bypass t-shirts on my timeline yeah I, I you know i think it's a positive thing uh, on paper again but but there's a lot of bad actors which i guess comes with every roblox update on earth i mean you give a roblox player anything and they'll just twist it into something god awful man <laughs> yeah if that's how you're wondering people were doing this and you haven't figured it out yet hey so yeah that's what's going on with that one but now let's move on the story that i kind of care about a lot that i just figured out so i actually saw this video on tiktok uh, it was uploaded four days ago okay and it's basically of a mother okay it has 500,000 likes okay and it's of a mother just talking about roblox and her problems with roblox because her son plays roblox okay a lot and he was actually banned for trying to refund his robux so roblox does actually ban people for trying to refund robux but now tldr it's like a three minute video where she just kind of frustrated she talks about talking with roblox support and how it's just garbage which by the way i am in complete support of now you might be asking okay people get banned all the all the time dude who cares because I've seen more videos on my For You page of people saying that this mother is, like, dumb or something. Why is she using the autism card on, on her son who got banned from Roblox for trying to do something illegal? I don't know why people are mad. Roblox is stupid. <laughs> like, in this situation, Roblox is dumb. Especially with how she explained it, if she's completely just telling the truth, which I, I wouldn't imagine why she would lie, okay? You know what I mean? I don't know why people are so mad on TikTok, but I've seen, like, multiple videos with thousands of likes. Unban. Unban the guy, man. It's not a big deal. Okay, um, but yeah, that's what's going on on roblox. Uh, I gotta go to bed. Bye. Bye